What is up guys, this is Fox Gaming, and this is part 4 of my Let's Build a Skyscraper series. I'm getting the hang of this, I think. This is what we have so far. We have the lobby, pretty much, which is two stories high. And then we have this beautiful, ugly lobby of mine, because I am just horrendous at interiors. But today we're going to do the bathrooms, which is nice. Nice bathrooms. This is the men's room. And on the opposite side, we have the ladies' room. Uh, and lighting, we're going to do this. We're going to get the nether brick fence. And there's going to be, since it's such a tall room, it's two stories, like I said. And I'm going to. I'm sorry if you can't see a thing, because I can't either. I'm just kind of shooting in the dark literally all right that's what i'm doing i'm kind of doing these three block tall lights that hang from the ceiling and that's not equal damn it i'll just do this i'll make a really big long one that's nice very nice um it's gonna be a one person bathroom uh i've only been in men's bathrooms and usually there's a stall, and then there's a stand-up urinal. I don't know how it is in women's bathrooms if they just have two. God, this is stupid. <laughs> what a weird thing to start off with. Um, and do you know what? I'm not going to... Actually, I am. Let's see. I'm just going to... I don't really know how to kind of make a fake bathroom that's believable. I guess this will be the toilet. Because. Do you know what? I'll make this for space reasons. I'll just make this like this big. Because usually there isn't any side space in urinal or stalls anyway. Fill it with water. I keep missing the water. I apologize. This must be just really bad to watch for people who are like, who have this interface down. I've been playing for over a year and I still don't have it down because I am not the smartest person. I am not a smart man. Where's the flusher, I guess? Um, let's go for some realism. Let's throw some poop in there. I missed. Oh, that's disgusting. There. Uh, I found a way. I just picked the poop back up. There's a really cool thing I learned. You take a button, I believe. You build, and then you put a... Like that, and then you get some white wool. Like so. Like it's toilet paper. Haha. <laughs> So clever, I'll put it down here. Uh, what was it? The button. I forgot to put the button down. Genius. Genius. I don't know if anyone's ever seen that picture. Like, toilet paper. Right down at your feet. Just like in a real bathroom. That is sarcasm. This is the women's bathroom, so there's gonna be two. Because... I don't know. Most women don't pee standing up. So I'm not going to put a stand-up urinal. And I said most women because I'm sure there's some weird ones out there. But I don't judge. Um, let's put some oh, farts. Still as clumsy as ever. I apologize. And I still get rid of shit I'm going to need later. So I have to go back and get it. There's the flusher. And then that's right, I have to put this, and there's a that, and then there's some more toilets. And I didn't come up with that. Someone on Reddit did. On our Minecraft. So I'm not taking credit for that. Let's have a four sink. And I, I can't put mirrors, damn. Wait, it would be pretty funny if the woman looking in the mirror was a creeper. I could get that one painting. Uh, yeah, 
yeah. There. She's looking in the mirror to realize that she's actually a creeper. That's the stupidest thing I've ever said. Uh, buttons. Let's put some buttons. Why? I don't know. Bathroom. That kind of resembles a bathroom. I'll make these look nicer. Ta-da! Then I'm going to put a door. Or a bunch of doors. I always do this. Because, like I said, I despise the texture for glowstone. And so, when in doubt, cover it up. No one has to look at that ugly shit. There we go. Can only cover one side, which is a bummer. But there you go. I'll put doors in later. No one needs doors. People could just walk into the stall awkwardly. Now for the men's bathroom. Which is going to be slightly different because we pee standing up. So there's going to be one stall for number two and then one for number one. This is a weird episode. I apologize for that. Uh, and I'm probably going to need that immediately. So why did I replace it? I'm trying to think. God damn it. Uh, stone or glass panes and fences are the worst. I'm trying to break them they're so tiny it's like pinpoint accuracy I need which and I don't have that so I usually just break everything around it because I'm a doofus uh, doors there we go put them all around um, hopefully they come out with a texture pack uh, the high Ross Ferry city I don't know it's a PC map, uh, and it actually comes with its own texture pack or resource pack, whatever they call it now. Uh, and it has really nice glowstone. It just kind of looks like one of those big, I don't know how to explain it, but there's usually those big kind of lights uh, outside of buildings or complexes. It, and they're just kind of plain white. That's what it looks like, and it looks awesome. And I actually put, when I uh, converted this map to the PC from Xbox, um, they, I downloaded the resource pack. And it looked alright, except for the uh, texture for dark gray wool is totally messed up. And like, all my streets are that. So, that's a bit of a problem. And I don't know how I'm going to do this. I know what I'll do. I'll do this. Just pee like that. And I'm going to build a wall. So there you go. Pee in there, and then floosh. And that's how it works. I'll just make this all clay. And... Again, I keep getting rid of the cauldron. Which isn't even a cauldron. It just looks like... There's things you wash dogs in. Ta-da! Isn't that a nice bathroom? It works, whatever. It's not the best, but it works. Now for the outside again. Now this is going to raise another floor. Five blocks. Let me situate myself again. I'm getting a neck cramp. Sorry about that. And there's a pig. I'm going to knock them off. Actually, that really pissed me off. That pig's is about to die. Shouldn't have messed with me, pig. That's right. I don't know why the animals are spawning on top of the building, but I don't like it one bit. Like I said probably a hundred times, the animals, there needs to be an option to turn off animals for you. They are getting really in the way. It's like, how do people not survive in survival if they're this abundant? I'm assuming they're as abundant on survival as they are on creative. And if not, that's just stupid. If they're, if they're more abundant on creative, 
that's just kind of mean, wouldn't you think? Like this guy. It's like, what do you want? Just get off of here. Once again, they're going to be five blocks high. Or five meters high. If I ever say meters, I just mean blocks. Because pretty much their meters, they're like scaled to be meters. Which is why Steve is two meters high. Oop, I saw inside my head. I'm a polar bear. In the game. I don't know why. I just like the face the polar bear has. Just kind of like this dumbfounded look. The funniest. I think it's the funniest skin. And it's getting dark. This place looks nice at dark. It's the best when it's at night. But sorry if like my gamma's down too low. I don't think it is though. It's like 80% I think. That's what I would always do. I would, like, when I first started, I didn't know about the gamma, and I'd, like, waste, like, hundreds of, uh, torches in survival. Like, venturing into a cave, I'd be like, oh, it's gonna get dark. Better make a shitload of torches. And then I realized that there's gamma, and you can just turn it up to 100. It'll, like, sear your eyeballs, but at least you could see in the dark. When it got bright, I'm pretty sure I gave myself eye cancer. And plus gamma doesn't sound too good. It sounds like some form of like I'm microwaving my eyes, which I probably am. Like just doing this, I'm sitting, all right, there's two. If I for some reason die of eye cancer, I think I know why. I There are two computer screens pointed at me and I'm sitting mere inches from a giant flat screen HD TV. So there's there's not gonna really gonna be a mystery if like my brain gets microwaved, or whatever the wife's tales say about sitting too close to the TV. Du -du -du. I'm pretty sure everyone's watching is also guilty of that. Uh, I'm gonna just continue the stairs and then I'm gonna start laying out the uh, floor plan which probably like if that doesn't make sense it will in about two seconds because I know I've been saying that a lot I'll be laying out the floor plan but without actually explaining it or explaining it poorly but I'm about to show you what I mean by that okay oh, this is this is just incredible stuff so exhilarating like, I realize these are like 20 minutes, and I don't know who I'm catering to, but whoever you are, you have very good listening skill, or very, you're very patient. The, the, the number one rule to this game is being very patient. Very patient. People always ask why, how I build this, and it's just like, you have to be really patient. Just listen to some good music. I recommend the new Arcade Fire album, The Reflector. That's a good album. For those of you who like rock and roll and electronic music. That sounded creepy. I presented that in a creepy way and I apologize. But it's a good album. I'd, I'd recommend it. They won Best Album, Arcade Fire won Best Album, two or Grammys 2010 for the suburbs which is also a really good album they're just really good band and i like them a lot and like i said i'm gonna be laying out the floor plan but i guess i lied i'm doing the windows first and i'm not gonna put the windows on before i do the floor plan i'll do the floor plan first and then do all the windows actually do you know what i'm probably gonna do the floor plan and then cut and then I'll do the windows, and then I'll start up part five with the windows already done, because no one wants no one wants to sit through me doing windows, because that is just boring. Alrighty, it's looking pretty good. 
even though I'm just kind of a chicken. Okay, so the animals are actually coming up through the stairwell. That's never happened before. They usually just kind of leave me alone, but this time they're, they have some sort of vendetta against me. They're actually learning to use stairs, which is kind of scary. I don't know what they're going to do with that power, but obviously it's going to involve annoying me. I don't know how I feel about the whole... Well, I don't see how any other... How they would do it in any other way. But, like, it's weird just kind of, like, having the maps end, but you can still see, like, that it goes on forever. Because it makes me feel like I can keep building, but I can't. So it's kind of, like, it's weird. Like, I could fill up the map, but it would feel still... It would still feel like this city was in the middle of nowhere. Because the maps... Like, they end, but they keep going. They end building-wise, but, like, the chunks are still there, I guess. Or I think they're chunks. Maybe they're not. Maybe they're just kind of, like, textures floating around. But Dune would be really cool another height raise. I need a height limit raise again. Because, I wanna, one, I want to put a spire on the World Trade Center. And I want to build a taller building. Like... Just give me 400 blocks, and I'd be set for life. Although, it, I'm pretty sure they, like, MacGyvered this entire game onto the disc, or onto the Xbox. So I'm not expecting any more. Like, I think it's just crazy that they're able to double the height limit. Just by, like, I guess, streamlining the code and shit. Uh, I'll make the hallways... Are the, yeah, okay, this is what I meant by um, the floor plan. What color should I make the walls? I will make them... I'll make them light blue. Because blue kind of is like the opposite of orange. That will look nice. And I hope this lines up. It does. Perfect. That's good. I'm not sure... I don't know if I should just extend the hallway all the way to this end, or if I should make the hallway only two blocks wide and have rooms on both sides. Because... Well, this, these would be pretty fairly sized rooms, so I'll just make it two blocks wide. This is going to be kind of a cramped building, but oh well. Or at least the hallway will be. And the room is on the right side. But this is what I meant by the floor plan. I'm actually going to build these all the way up to the fifth block. Or up five blocks, I mean. Like this. Actually, I'm only going to build them up four for right now. Let me actually put in lights. And this is what I meant by uh, two block high. Um was I about to say? Two block high flo uh, floors. And I'm not talking about the entire block. Or I'm not talking about the entire floor. I'm talking about like the floor that you step on. So there's going to be one layer for the lights. Which would be this one. And then I'm going to cover the lights. So it's going to be... I guess I'll make the lights like this. Down the hallway. Which again, I really hate the... Um, texture for glowstone but there really isn't any alternative and there's probably going to be an alternative but they're going to like muff up one of the other textures and it's going to make the entire city look stupid so I guess I'm just going to have to deal with the one bad texture instead of like it being repaired but at the cost of like all the other textures and it's always the iron texture they always mess up the iron texture so this is probably not going to look too sh nice, but it'll work. And like I said, like ten times, it's not... This isn't, like, my best build, but it, it's simple enough. 
and there's going to be a window here. So that's pretty much that. That's going to be the hallway. And now I'm going to build rooms. Um, I can have it. Before I build the rooms, I'm going to... Well, let's make the rooms a different color of wall. Let's make them red. Because the red's a cool color. Very nice. So let me walk. Actually, do you know what? This is going to be like a open area. Kind of like a commons, I guess, for each floor. So the hallway isn't really going to start until here. I'm just kind of like deleting everything I just did. I guess it's going to be more of a regi residential place. Which will make sense because there's actually a lot of hotels around this area. Like the sandstone, that one's kind of a hotel. And the World Trade Center has the hotel. Um, that looks pretty good. And I'll, I'm going to make this. I'm going to make the uh, walls in the rooms a different color than blue but just because this is a common area and this it's kind of like this wall wrapping around I'll just make this part blue because it's like it's the, still this wall it's just like I said wrapping around and that's gonna look nice and it's gonna kind of make a T so the hallway is kind of like just this giant T or it's a hallway that goes into the commons area like this and I'll probably go back or you guys can go back I'm probably not gonna go back and but you could go back and put in the well I like repeated myself ten times you could go back and put in like I don't know paintings and stuff all right so that's pretty much uh, the hallway it's gonna be this big commons area where I don't know you put stuff and then these are gonna be rooms separated by red walls because why not? And I'll make them each have two window, two windows like that. So one, two, and then on the third one I'll make a, and I don't think this is going to add up at the end. There's probably going to be one room that's either bigger or smaller than all the others. Looks like it's going to be smaller. This will be like utilities or make this tiny room on the corner a bathroom even. Although... It's a pretty revealing bathroom with windows on each side. But oh well, this is Minecraft. This ain't real life. And just to let you know, this isn't real life. I don't spend all time I don't spend my entire time playing this game. I know this is like a big ass city, and I spend a lot of time building it, but I I assure you I have a life other than this. Not trying to talk bad about people who play this all the time but I'm just just saying and I'm not trying to toot my own horn but I do have a life other than Minecraft it just is what I do in my free time other than hang out with friends I'm actually building websites now for people uh, which is fun JavaScript HTML CSS those are fun I would look into computer science. It is pretty interesting. And plus you get to like know how sites work. And actually like you know Bitfit, I made that video that like maybe two of you saw um and how they are actually like letting people help with the kind of process of making it. Like that's kind of how I want to contribute. I'm probably going to do graphic design stuff if I like get some sort of position. And even if I don't like, I'll still help out, but I'll try and help out with, like, some CSS or kind of laying out their web page and stuff. Um, this is a good place to actually stop, because it's 24 minutes. Uh, so if it, we're starting on the third floor. Didn't add these yet, but I will. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I'll do the windows and then start recording part five i think part five yeah part five uh this has been fox gaming i hope you enjoyed be sure to check out the next part and the previous part uh see ya that's pretty much it
Bye.